हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वंस अगेन वेलकम टू भोलानाथ एकेडमी इन दिस वीडियो स्टूडेंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू सी द क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री इन क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री स्टूडेंट्स यू हैव 200 हंड्रेड मिली लीटर इथिलीन गैस एंड वन फिफ्टी मिली लीटर ऑफ एस सी एल गैस वे आर अलाउड टू रिएक्ट एट वन बार प्रेशर अकॉर्डिंग टू द रिएक्शन स्टूडेंट्स इथिलीन गैस इज गिवन टू यू इथिलीन गैस एंड एस सी एल गैस बोथ आर रिएक्टिंग एंड दे आर फॉर्मिंग इथाइल क्लोराइड गैस अंडरस्टैंडिंग स्टूडेंट्स here the pressure is given 1 bar you have to calculate the pressure volume work in joule okay students you have to calculate the work done in joule so here students what is given here the 200 ml ethylene gas and 150 ml of hcl gas were allowed to react at 1 bar pressure so this is the reaction is very important students since here students 1 mole 1 mole ethylene gas react with 1 mole of hcl gas and it is giving 1 mole of ethyl chloride gas so at the time what will be the work done students here the when you see students one volume of ethylene gas combines with one one mole one volume of hcl gas and it is given only one mole of ethyl chloride gas understanding students so here students what will be there here two volume is going to be converted into one volume that means students when you are taking here one mole of hcl will always react with one mole of ethylene gas ethylene gas students and here is hcl gas so according to this reaction students what and you have to calculate the pressure type volume type of work so students please pay attention so here students 150 ml if you are taking 150 ml hcl it will always react with 150 ml of ethylene gas out of 200 students it will accept only 150 ml understanding students how out of 200 ml here students if it is 150 so it will be also 150 understanding 50 ml will not react with hcl understanding students and you are getting 150 ml of ethyl chloride understanding students so here students what is given so initial volume if you are want to take initial volume is nothing but 150 ml of ethylene gas react with 150 ml of hcl so initial volume will be what 300 ml okay students this is ml so if you want to convert into liter students you have to divide this quantity by 1000 Okay, students. If you divide by thousand students, now it will convert into liter. That is equals to point three liter. Understanding, students. Similarly, students. What will be the final volume? Final volume that is V two is given, students. V two is nothing but one fifty milliliter. Now that also you have to convert this. This is liter, students. This you can also write point three dm cube. Understanding, students. Liter is nothing but dm cube. Same thing, students. You have to do do in the second. That is in product side, one fifty. You have to divide with thousand. So it will convert into liter. So decimal before three digit, you have to put the decimal point one five zero liter. This you can write point one five. This is nothing but point one five dm cube. Okay, students, understanding? So if you divide this by thousand, you have to convert into liter. This liter is nothing but dm. Now you know the initial volume, and now you know the final volume. Understanding, students? And you know the external pressure that is P external is also given. So what will be the work done, students? Work done will be. Since you know the formula, students. Since you know the formula, capital W work is nothing but minus P external into delta V. Okay, students. Minus P external into that is V two minus V one. Here, students. Minus P external is nothing but one is given one bar, one bar, multiplying with V two is given, students. That is point one five dm cube minus. 0.30 dm cube. Okay, students. When you subtract, students, because it is a bigger, so it will come in negative, students. So minus one bar will be as it is. You have to when you subtract, students, you will get point one five one five dm cube. Okay, students. When you multiply, students, negative negative it will be positive. So you are getting point one five dm cube bar. Okay, students. Since students, you know. Since so this is the work done, students. In dm cube bar, but in questions, students they are asking in joule. Since students, you know, one dm cube bar equals to hundred joule. So you have to multiply. Okay, students. So this much dm cube bar will how much joule? So zero point one five. You have to multiply with hundred. So it will convert into joule. So what happens, students? The decimal will be removed. First to multiply. Before two digit put the decimal. So now it is the work done. So this is way, students. You can calculate the work done in this. Sums. It is very important, friends. Like my video, please share it, subscribe it. Thank you, thank you very much. Have a nice day. God bless you.